Hello everyone, uh, this is Shaker. Hope you are all doing good. Okay, there was an interesting question today at the community.splunk.com. One user asked the question, can anyone provide a link to Splunk Mission Control API documentation? So I thought to take this opportunity and also in the in the in my Splunk training, sometimes many new users do not know exactly how to do how to search the Splunk documentations. So I thought to make a small video about these two concepts. First of all, the Splunk documentation is very, very, very perfect one, very good one actually, I would say. As I have worked in multiple tools and multiple things like even the Linux and all and uh, other tools. The Splunk documentation is very much neatly uh, perfectly documented. Just it just like a library, bookshelf in the library. You can see that simply docs.splunk.com that is the home page. Under that one we have multiple tabs like the platform, security, ID, developer tools, apps, add-ons, everything. Most of the time you would be going to Splunk Enterprise because most of us would be working on the enterprise. If you are using cloud, if you are if you're looking for UF documentation, data processor, cloud services, I don't know what is cloud platform and cloud services, why there are two different tabs. Sometime it happens. Okay, enterprise security. We, for security, we got a separate tab for years. For SOAR Cloud, SOAR on premise, Phantom, UBA is an, another tool. There are many more security related apps as well. Mission Control is located here. For IT, we have IT service intelligence and uh, some other apps. For observability, we need to go here uh, for apps and add-ons. See, note down that premium apps are listed here. Enterprise security, IT service intelligence, UBA, these things are premium apps. The free apps are community supported apps are located here. We got a very big list of you can you may know that Splunk Machine Learning Toolkit is a free app actually. So you you see for, there is an app for AI Assistant as well. There is a very big list of apps, so you no need to worry. Uh, of course, uh, Splunk Base got its own documentation as well. So there are developer tools, this that, this that, lot of things. So for this particular question, we need to go to mission control. Okay, what is mission control? The mission control is actually an integrated security operations for the cloud. Okay, let's say, for example, if you are using enterprise security, for troubleshooting the enterprise security, security related issues you would you would use your es or es app itself for for the cloud many for many many times or multiple times you need to contact to the splunk support itself those issues those things common triage types investigation methods respond to security incidents from uh, cloud-based console they created this documentation this service this product mission control together you can see that there are i, I believe it is a just just recently they started this service actually as you can see that we got no previous records when you go under the particular tab we you can see that there is a release, release notes, description, API documentation, many things, many things. So I hope you guys learned some 
something at least from this video see you in the next video catch you later bye thanks